Hey there! So, you want to learn how to get Adobe Illustrator on Windows PC for free? Well, I'm about to show you exactly how to do that in this video. It's completely legal, legitimate, and works for both Windows and Mac computers. Plus, you won't have to download anything. Sounds good, right? Let's dive in. First step, grab your computer and open up any web browser. For this video, I'm using Google Chrome, but any browser will do the trick. Next, go ahead and type in photop.com into your search bar. Hit enter, and it'll bring you straight to the website. You can close the big portion at the top by clicking the X, and voila, you're in. Photop is a powerful online tool that mimics Adobe Illustrator's interface and functionality. You can click Open from Computer to load any legitimate Adobe Illustrator file or other supported file types listed at the bottom. Let me show you how easy it is. I'll click New Project, and from here, you can set your dimensions and other settings. You can also choose from a variety of presets. For example, I'll select YouTube Cover and hit Create. And just like that, you have a blank canvas, just like an Adobe Illustrator. On the left-hand side, you'll see all the familiar tools, and along the top, you have menus like File, Edit, and More. It's basically Adobe Illustrator in your browser, for free. Now, you might be wondering if this is legal. Absolutely. Photopea is the brainchild of talented developers who wrote their own code to create this Adobe Illustrator-like experience. It's not owned by Adobe, and it's supported by ads, which is why it's free. You might notice some ads on the right-hand side. They're not too intrusive, but if they bother you, you can always use an ad blocker, or even use an ad-free browser like Brave. Either way, there are no annoying pop-ups. And that's how you can get Adobe Illustrator-like experience for free on your Windows PC. If you found this helpful, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more tips and tricks. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.